I'm Natalia Bonner. It's day 209. Today we're going to be stitching using my 4-in-1 machine quilting ruler. Before we hop over to the video though, I do want to mention that my brand new class, Let's Stitch Scallop Borders, from this awesome panel, starts January 1st. This super fun class is on sale right now through January 1st for just $35. So it's a steal. It's going to be such a great class. I'm way excited about it. Make sure you do check out all the details for this class over on my website, peaceandquilt.com. But in the meantime, let's get stitching. I'll begin by using my blue Mark Beyond marker and marking the center on all three sides of my triangle block. From there, I'll begin stitching at the bottom center point. I'll stitch using the largest curve on the 4-in-1 machine quilting ruler, a curve to the top point, then back down to the center bottom point. From there, I'll adjust my ruler and stitch a curved line over to the mark point on the right side of the block, and then back down to the point where I started. From there, I'll repeat that same process on the left side of the block. Once I've stitched all of those petals, now I'm going to go through, using the largest curve on my 4-in-1 machine quilting ruler, I'm going to stitch an echo all the way around the outside of this motif. I like the way that echo stitching just kind of ties everything together. So I'll line up the ruler so that the curve line is right on top of my previous stitch line. You'll always want to make sure you're using a ruler foot that has a quarter inch spacing. After I've stitched the echo all the way around the outside of the block, I'll stitch in the ditch to finish off this design. I hope you enjoyed today's block and found a little bit of inspiration with my machine quilting. Now just remember, you can pick up the panel, the rulers, the thread, all of the notions that I'm using in this video today over on my website, peaceandquilt.com. And don't forget to share your progress pictures over on Instagram using the hashtag Let's Stitch with Natalia. That's where we will be selecting winners for weekly prizes. See you all tomorrow.